You can do it. Oh, f Come on. As far back as I can remember, I've always bitten off more than I can chew. Last year, I signed up for the ultimate secret Shh. Santa. No witnesses. The Fools with Tools treasure trade, where I attempted to make a meaningful gift for someone I didn't even know. It was just a little bit stressful. Oh, f the f balls this up. How oh, much f he is? For God's sakes, tell him to cut the white wire. So naturally, I thought it was a great idea to do it all again. Is it going to be worth the pain? Alright, this year's project. My ego says that I need to make it as good or if not better than last year's. So I've got my work cut out for me. First things first, we need to do some research. Now they've told me that he likes football, Star Wars and role playing, none of which we're going to focus on. I did what any normal person would do and stalked the hell out of him on social media. Ooh, look at that. In my research, I found that he has a love for cooking and an affinity for Viking culture and craft. So I'm going to blend those two ideas together and I came up with this amazing idea, a Viking ship cookbook holder. But I've learned a couple of things from last year. I've got to be better prepared. So I've come up with a plan. First things first, I'm going to go buy some actual carving wood because last year carving pine was a nightmare. Then rather than actually carve it, I'm going to see and see it out. That's going to be a lot easier. So that's the next step of the plan. Then it's as simple as sanding it back a little bit, applying some finishing oil, packing it in a box, and happy snappy Christmas. Enough talk, now we need to make this idea reality. All right, off to the wood shop. Hi. I'm after some basswood. How much? Are you kidding me? Well, this plan was off to a great start. Plan B. I had this beech wood lying around my workshop. I guess it's going to have to do. But before we can see and see it, we need to make sure this is all nice and flat, ready to go. Right, the design. There's no need to reinvent the wheel. There's plenty of people 3D modeling Viking ships. So all we have to do is convert this into a G-code, then call my friend Jürgen to borrow his CNC. Hey, I just finished the G-code on this new project. When can I swing by and use your CNC, man? Uh, I'm in the Canadian Arctic on a, on a research vessel. I'll be back in a month. Ah, why is something ever got a plan? All right, plan C. Let's do this the old school way with HNC, Human Numerical Control.
No, that doesn't look right. Ah, I took the wrong stain. Motherfucker. Looks like we're gonna have to go darker. finished? Yep, right before the deadline of the 22nd. You do realise it's the 23rd today, right? Can I get a gingerbread oat latte to go? Thank you. guys was it worth the pain well the guy loved it which is awesome but I tell you what I got a lot from this as well look things never go according to plan and sometimes you just have to believe in yourself and your idea and push through the hard times push through the balls ups and just keep on going and when you finish the project make sure you share it with someone show people what you're doing that's why I made this video I want to change the world just a little bit and make it a little bit more creative and if you want to check out how I changed the world a little bit in my last Secret Santa project, check out the link here. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone.